Well, sure enough, we, we are in a perfect summertime weather pattern. Look at the view out at Ski Bowl, and uh, you can see uh, it's nice out there right now with uh, temperatures in the 60s there. And then uh, Vancouver, uh, Mary Hill Tasting Room and Bistro Camera, 78 degrees there. And then uh, down in the valley, it's, it's a little bit warmer. Temperatures in spots have been uh, just slightly over 80 degrees. Stoller Family Estate, also Willamette Valley Vineyards have been up in the low 80s. All right, so look at the numbers so far today. We've hit 79 in Portland. Typical high temperature is uh, 83 degrees. And we may still rise another degree or two. I wouldn't be surprised if we hit 80 or 81. So pretty typical mid-July day. And, and when I say we're in a real classic like summertime pattern, by that I mean I don't see any rain in the next week, week and a half. And, and I see the temperatures just kind of going uphill and downhill as we get that seesaw. The cool ocean air comes in some days. It keeps us a little cooler like nature's air conditioning. Other days the ocean air backs off and a little what we call thinner marine layer, which means uh, we'll be a, a little bit warmer. So what's ahead? Okay, big picture, like I said, no rain in sight. That may last through the end of the month. Um, we do have high pressure over us. And when we get more of that, it's kind of sinking air. And when we see more of that in the summertime and it builds a little stronger over us, basically squishes down that layer of that cool ocean air coming inland. So we tend to warm up. So notice the morning cloud cover forecast tomorrow. There's like almost nothing. I think we'll start with sunshine west of the Cascades. And it'll be the same way coming up on Wednesday. Now, by the time we get to Thursday, let's go a little farther ahead here. And on Thursday, yeah, you see a little thicker push of those ocean clouds. That's going to cool us off. So if you think the next two days are a little warm for you, 90 or 91, the good news is it'll be a little bit cooler once we get to Thursday. So looking at just the next three days, right around 90 the next two days, I'd call that kind of on the edge of hot, right? And then back into the 80s with morning clouds on Thursday. And Friday, cooler, yeah, we may stay only around 80 degrees Friday. Saturday, a little warmer, low 80s, but still nice. The fourth weekend of July looks great. And we're thinking there's a pretty decent chance that we may have a heat wave beginning Sunday or Monday. Our models are, you know, always in disagreement a little bit that far out. But the general idea is, yeah, warm, kind of hot for two days, Pete. A little cooler, then a little warmer. And who knows what happens 10 days out. But it's summertime.